did some Googling, but I couldn't really find an answer how the Biambu Labs X1 Carbon would handle running out of filament. So we're about to test it. Uh, this is the sample filament right here that I got with the printer, about 250 grams. I wanna see how the printer handles it. And really my biggest question is, assuming this pops out and doesn't damage anything, which looks like it might. Ah, see, there's a problem. Ah, see, it snapped out. All right, cool. We'll continue. So that was the first test. Just see, I guess that's really dependent on the packager of the filament. A little scary, but did really require intervention. It did eventually come loose. I think that if it was anywhere tightened at all harder, it would have probably damaged the uh, feeder mechanism. But we'll see what the printer does now. Ideally, it will pause and give me the option to resume the print and enter new parameters for a new roll of filament because these are not the same filament type as the sample PLA one I got with the printer. So we'll see what happens. Not too worried if this fails because it's kind of a throwaway print. Poop shoot to the back of the printer. Probably be hitting the end of it right about now-ish. Up. Oh. Did it figure out that it ran out of filament? Aha! There it is. Filament ran out. Please load new filament. In temperature axis, then tap resume to resume the print job. All right. Well, there we go. So if we go to temperature axis, filament. Uh, so yeah, so now we can set everything like as if we were loading another piece of filament. Perfect. That's all I wanted to know, and hopefully somebody else finds this useful. As a follow-up, here's a very important detail right here that I didn't realize. Setting slot information while printing is not supported, which means that whatever filament you reload in the middle of a print has to have the same or close to the same requirements as the one you were printing with. Color obviously doesn't matter, but things like minimal maximum temperature are pretty important.